whole team approach. One of the biggest differences in agile and traditional development approaches is the whole team approach. Now what is a whole team approach? In whole team approach there are some key factors that agile uh, manifesto outlines and with, with with whole team approach the first point to note is that quality is everyone's responsibility in the team it's not about having uh, the quality as a responsibility of the testing team or uh, just just the developers so it's basically responsibility of each and every member of the team uh, be it uh, the development team member or business stakeholder or customer it's basically uh, a closed collaborated team so quality is responsibility of each and every member in the team it's not any particular team's responsibility now the second point says development team business stakeholders and customers work together so agile teams are uh, formed by um, hiring the right set of people and who are self-motivated self-starter and work towards the common goal so you hire the right set of people in the development team business stakeholders and customers they all can come together and know the goal towards which they are working for and everyone self-organize and work towards that common goal next thing is co-located team co-located teams are also very important in agile because co-location facilitates communication and interaction now if the teams are co-located there will be a lot of um, communication if there are any doubts to any team member they can approach to the other team members and clarify those doubts and ensure that everyone is on same page and working um, and working towards that particular common goal daily stand-up meetings is another very important thing in um, agile approach and whole team approach as well so daily stand-up meetings are organized in whole team approach wherein these stand-up meetings are very short uh, 15 minutes meeting every day wherein the team comes together uh, and uh, mentions what they were working uh, yesterday what they are working today and if there are any particular bro blockers that can be resolved by the um, uh, team members if um, if any other member can help and resolve those issues so these daily stand-ups are also uh, very important now the other point in whole team approach is that um, co-location enhances collaboration and communication uh, because the teams are self-organized and co-located this enhances collaboration and communication within the team members a lot and because of this collaboration and communication everyone understands what they are working towards and there is a transparency within the team and everyone knows the goal towards the, which they are working for agile teams are also relatively very small team um, the the team should not be more than um, like it should be three to nine people not more than nine people because the small teams can organize very well um, they can communicate and collaborate and know the goal towards which they are working for if the teams are very big then uh, this communication collaboration within the big teams is very difficult and not fruitful so this these are some of the key points for whole team approach